All right, guys, I am a day late again, but uh, I do have some cool uh, videos to show you. Uh, first is a Kingdom Hearts Union Cross update, uh, and after the update, then obviously I will be pulling for uh, Riku, uh, or Niku, Illustrated Niku, or whatever his name is, to try to guilt him, and uh, then uh, another uh, 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 Illustrated Kyrie EX, I'm going to try to pull for her. So, we go to the update. Uh... What am I doing? So let's go here. Let's go to notices. Start making faces because my allergies are killing me. So, uh, on the 6th, we have the Assault Dragon Daily Raid event. Uh, it runs to the 12th. It's at 3 o'clock Eastern Time and runs from 3 to 4 and from uh, 10 to 11 Eastern Time. Earn jewels in the exclusive Trickmaster Medal from the Daily Raid event. Each day at the following times, the Assault Dragon Raid Boss will appear for only one hour. From 3, uh, 3 o'clock uh, Eastern and 10 o'clock Eastern, this time there will be a total of seven event boards, one unlocking each day of the event. While the event board t contents will change daily, the following will be available as rewards each day. Two Trickmaster Medals, one Boosted Trickmaster Medal, Boosted Trickmaster 1,000 more base strength. You get event coins every five levels. The Raid Boss's level will reset every day. Raid Boss will not yield any event coins after level 50. Event Board will remain open until 30 minutes after the one-hour window. Event coins will carry over between days. So... Work together with your party to level up and defeat the raid boss within the time limit to earn event coins, which you can use to earn jewels, the exclusive Trickmaster medals, and the following fabulous rewards. So, November 6th, which is a Monday, uh, which I missed, you get a six-star chip. November 7th, Tuesday, it's a uh, six-star Dale. November 8th, which is a Wednesday, is a six-star Sid. November 9th, which is a Thursday, is a six-star Chip. November 10th, which is a Friday, is a six-star Dale. November 11th, which is Saturday, is a six-star Sid. And then the 12th, which is Sunday, is a six-star Magic Mirror. So, I missed Monday because I was working all day and then missed it at night. Uh, I was playing Assassin's Creed uh, Origins, so that didn't happen. Powerful Bosses in Union Cross. This runs to the 12th. Team up with party members to defeat these powerful bosses. Challenge even stronger bosses during challenge boss time. So on Monday, the attribute will be power. Tuesday will be speed. Wednesday will be magic. And then Thursday, the 9th power. Friday, the 10th speed. Saturday, the 11th magic. And Sunday, the 12th magic. This time, there's a total of four cross boards, two of which will be unlocked from the start. The third board will be unlocked after completing Magic Mirror Set Number 1. Complete them to earn jewels and other great rewards. You have Magic Broom Set, Magic Mirror Set Number 1, Magic Mirror Set Number 2, Magic Mirror Set Number 3. The Challenge Boss Times. During the periods listed below, each daily Challenge Boss Times will occur at least for 30 minutes twice each day. By defeating these bosses during these times, a Challenge Boss Quest where you can receive a large number of cross coins will be unlocked. From 10 to 1029 Eastern, and from... 2 to 2.29 a.m. Eastern. Bonus times during the periods listed below daily. Bonus times will occur in last 30 minutes twice each day. Same times. 10 to 10.29, 2 to 2.29. So, weekly gem quest, November 6th. Uh, for this week, it is a power gem. Uh, pretty easy stuff. You know the drill. And then for the second half of the art, TWWY VIP quest, part two and more, and zero AP campaign, uh, from the 12th VIP quest campaign period, um, you get Art, the World Ends With You. Uh, you get four Art, the World Ends With You medals and 1,400 jewels. Uh, they return for another week. Complete these quests to obtain a total of four Art, the World Ends With You medals and 1,400 jewels. And if just in case you forgot the middle details, it is a power tier six upright, zero cost AOE, restores seven gauges and cures own status ailments. For one turn, raises power speed, magic strength, one tier, and lowers targets power speed, magic defense, one tier, and flicks a fixed amount of damage on a bad uh, VIP quests, uh, get two power, speed, and magic uh, gems. Complete these quests, earn six gems in total, two power gems, two speed gems, two magic gems, and VIP magic mirror quests are back. Complete these quests, earn seven magic mirrors. So that's huge. Uh, this VIP this week is actually not bad. Last week's was kind of lame. This week you actually get you get gems, you get some magic mirrors, you get the other, uh, the ability to guilt the um, uh, art, the, um, you know, uh, the world ends with you, uh, metal. So not a bad update uh, for Monday. This is Tuesday now. Um, now, when you see the uh, consequent videos uh, after this one, they were actually recorded on Monday. My plan was to be able to 
to uh, record this Monday as well. I didn't have time. So this is Monday's update, um, but the other two videos you'll see when I play, when I pulled for Illustrated Niku and, uh, and Illustrated Kyrie X again, you'll see those coming up. So thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you soon.